My name is Arjun Vajpayee and I am India's first professional mountaineer. There are 14 peaks above 8,000 meters. Uh, I have successfully climbed 6 out of the 14 and I am not only the youngest Indian to do so but also the youngest person in the world to do these 6 summits above 8,000 meters. Life above 8,000 meters feels uh, more at home than when I am back in the cities. I think the most important resource, often uh, most uh, you know, uh, underestimated, um, is uh, every year. Obviously, there'll be better gear. Every year, there'll be better equipment which will be on board. Uh, but something which we highly underestimate is the mind. Uh, the secret to climbing 8,000 meter mountains is definitely not in, uh, in 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 the kind of gear or the kind of people you are climbing with, but the kind of mindset with the kind of mental fitness which you harness and I think that's the most important thing which uh, a mountaineer needs more, more than having a, a six pack on their abs you need a six pack up here for sure It's uh, definitely very interesting to know that Seiko Prospects has always uh, stood for pushing the known boundaries in the field of adventure may be reaching the North Pole, may be reaching the South Pole or may be reaching the top of Everest itself. And it's always known for its reliability and uh, known for how, how, how much can withstand these harsh conditions. I think uh, since its inception in 1965, the engineers back in uh, Seiko has always believed in uh, pushing the limits, pushing their boundaries. Uh, because if you stop pushing your boundaries, uh, you're basically done. I find this similarity between uh, Seiko prospects and high mountains, 8,000 meter peaks, that uh, if you stop, if you stop pushing your limits, if you stop pushing your boundaries, if you stop overcoming challenges, uh, you're done. You're basically done on the mountain. You always have to keep going forward. When I think about Seco Prospects on uh, 8,000 meter mountains, uh, the first thing which just comes into my mind is I can, very, very, very easy to read when I'm climbing. The legibility is fantastic. Uh, when we are climbing for our summit pushes in the dark from the last camp all the way to the summit. The Lumi Bright which they are using, that's what they at least call it, is, is absolutely out of this world. It seems like we have a billion stars up in the sky and we have a couple of stars here in our watch glowing out in the night uh, and obviously the build quality. Uh, surviving those harsh conditions, uh, I think the build quality has to be fantastic to be able to stand uh, out there on these summits along with us. Keep going forward. Prospects. Seiko.